Hello guys, welcome back to another Let's Play of my Age of Wonders series. My name's Karen with Exploraminate, and we're playing as Dwayne the Delusional, our beloved little neighborhood uh, arch druid, right? <laughs> uh, anyways, so we left off, we went treasure hunting, and I think this was legendary. Anyways, we stomped it, it like wasn't even difficult. So, uh, if there are any other really high level treasure, ooh, over here would be good. Let's send Dwayne over here. All right. So we're just kind of treasure hunting right now, while at the same time trying to get an idea of how strong the theocrat is. Level seven here. That's, I mean, that's respectable, right? Some Naga, some tier. Th okay, tier three martyrs, not martyrs. Exalted, right? Yeah, that's kind of significant. Alright, let's cast this. So. Oh, that's cool, that graphic, the horses. Okay, that that was a really cool spell, actually. Alright, so the one of my forces become one with the wild, so I move really fast anywhere. So I get floating and strong will on all the units. That's pretty cool. It's why not reinforce that? There we go. So Jeez, that means it doesn't matter. We're we're just flying. I can't move. Oh well. Favorite enemy. Have I really researched everything already? That's too bad. I really do enjoy researching. Like the research in this game is just kind of fun. The it's it's randomized quite well. Uh, I'm just gonna keep building stuff on this. Uh, I want to call it like the Mermaid Town. What is it? Oh, Merfolk dwelling. Okay, I wasn't too far off. <laughs> That wasn't quite right. Feathered serpents are like nice, but a tier three with sixty health, I feel like I could do better. Throw a siege workshop in a barracks. Well, uh, that way um, I can be producing units closer to the front. Right now, uh, kind of stuck back here, right? Mm. Unexplored legendary. Ooh, let's go for that. See how well my my uh, swimming mammoths would uh, do. Those are fun creatures, though. All right, so we'll keep exploring down here. Try to figure out what's going on with his town. Ah, uh, no, his town, his empire. You know how far back he can fall. I guess it's only to the edge of the map, right? So praise the leader. Cool, got some gold. Produced a solar spire. That's fine. Let's. I guess I'll produce more. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm sitting on 9,000 gold, right? What do I do? Okay, new research. Hellfire. Blast the entire battlefield with searing heat, dealing 30 physical damage to all walls and 50 fire damage to all units on the battlefield. Dang! That's, uh actually pretty good. I could run a unit in and do like a, a suicide run with him if that makes sense. It'd be pretty cheap but uh, quite effective at the same time I'd say. Alright, this guy is slowing me down. I need to replace him with a, a mammoth or something. I'm tired of going slow. I mean I really like that guy. That's the issue. But I am playing with Resurgence so it's probably not quite the end of the world. There we go. Got our movement back. So this is mythical. Ooh, I don't think it's better than that. Probable victory. Um, do I go for it? I think I do. I return to battlefield three turns after. Um, yeah, let's try it. I mean... No no glory if you don't try. Oh, I do like this. These battlefields are really cool looking. Just the, uh, I don't know, it looks like glass reflectance almost, right? And then you can see all the, the spirits of the dead down there doing their thing. Alright, so they're going to try doing invoke death. They're not actually that strong, are they? They got fire weakness, that's nice. How far can they travel? Oh, 
Come on, a day. Okay, so that's actually out of the Reaper's grasp, which is good for me. Oh, gotta go a little further if you wanna get out of this guy's possible reach. Um, Alright, so we're out of range. What do we wanna cast on everyone now? We get Hornet Swarm. That's gonna be too effective. I think they have Blight Protection. Most everyone should. I could do Ancestral Spirits, Colby's Towards, Maskers. Oh, I don't know. Shield of Light. So, I mean, that could be beneficial, because I'm pretty sure these guys are... These guys should be evil, right? Dying, that's of all. Dead. Huh. Doesn't say they're, like, dedicated to evil, so... Oh, I'm trying to remember. There's so much in this game, sometimes I'm still, like, you know, it kind of slips in my mind. Okay, let's just throw an Ancestral Spirit up right there. We'll get some units to take the flank hits, that, that sort of thing. Uh, I guess that's the turn. They can blink strike. They're going to, aren't they? Yeah. It's not too bad, though. Oh, what? You're not supposed to be able to hit my mammoth. He's going to get a charge off on you. That, that was my bad. I assumed you should never do that in this game. It's all right. I think we'll survive. The thing is, I have to kill everybody really quickly because if I don't, I'm just hosed. All right, kill the spirits. All right, they're dead. That's a thing. Smash him. There's a flank. No energy drain, so that's good. Broken spirit. What's that do? I don't actually know. Wow. That is really bad morale. This guy is going to fumble pretty much everything in the world, to be honest. So, Monster Slayer. Yeah, it's not bad. Void Implosion got me. That's okay. Happens to the best of us. I might actually have this. Oh, that's a horrible camera angle. Okay. My guys regenerate, so... I'll just... If we can't beat them to death. So I've got, what, like, two, three turns till they come back? Three turns with 35% of their health. I think I got that. My my early concern was obviously if you know I kill one of the uh what are these guys even called dread reapers. Oh yeah, they are dread reapers. <laughs> uh believe in myself, I guess, is the moral of the story. Uh I'd kill them but then they'd be coming back and I'd just be like chaining them the whole time. That's what I was terrified would happen. Oh, he leveled up. Excellent. And you should be able to finish him off. Oh, you're not dead yet? Really? Come on, Dread Reaper, just go down. Was that it? Oh, we gotta level up on the uh, Mammoth Boy. It's always good. Always good at those elites. Alright, so we vanquished him, didn't lose anybody, gained some veterancy. What's veteran actually add? Uh, a little bit. Uh, oh, a defense. That's good. 17 defense is quite good. All right. He's getting up there. Frost Queen's crown. 200 frost protection? What do you need 200% frost protection from? Is that like they... Okay. I can't even figure out what that means, but that's cool. This gives you protection from a lot of stuff. Goodness. Yeah, we're going to take that. Um, so, Blight and Fire Protection completely, really. 
So am I now like 100%? Oh, it's... Hold on. 200% frost protection, though. What? Is that going to, like, show up? That has to be a typo. Huh. Yeah, I, I do like this. This better. Um, we can give this to... Give it to the rogue. I think that was the witch. Oh, well. If not. Someone will get it in a turn or two. So, yeah. This is definitely my uh, death stack. All-knowing. You received two new specializations. Chosen at random. Oh, that's cool. Gotta remember, you still have stuff to research. Um, what to do here? Uh, this will pave the way for it. I kind of want another great temple just to get those casting points up. Why not, right? Enter closely matched. I don't like closely matched things. Is it because it's going to be on boats? I hope not. I hate naval combat. Yeah, it's not on boats good. I guess you're like... What? He can't just shoot a cannon at me with that warning. Look at that. Uh, this is actually kind of a cool battlefield where it's... uh Seems to be half submerged. You know? Alright, here we go. Boom. Devastating charge. But they have physical protection. That's... That's the kicker there. I cast on them. They got... Yeah, they have blight protection. What am I thinking? Not that. Um, I could do... Not call beast towards because they don't have enough. From spirit. Ancestral spirit. Poison blades. Quick bad dash. I'm not seeing anything that like really calls out to me. Let's just give me an ancestral spirit right there. Why not? I'll break their spirit. See that? Their spirit broke right there. Didn't quite kill him. Alright. get some shots off because it would be really nice to actually kill some oh, I'm not gonna kill him. that stinks with their physical protection it really makes life annoying for me it's gonna be doing a lot of damage and they have life steal I guess we'll just gang up on this guy we'll see how this goes I'm actually really not too confident or sure about this Wow that was pretty cool, actually. I want to get me one of those. Oh, I fumbled. It's too bad. I'm gonna flank my hero. Yeah. I resisted your despair strike, though, so. Alright, he's dead. Let's move one back to get the devastating charge off. That's basically what we're doing there. Uh, they have frost protection. They have a lot of protection. Alright. For here. If we can finish some of these races off, I'll feel better. Because even if I start losing guys, it's okay if they die. Oh, sweet. Here we go. Okay, well, I'll lose that Mammoth Rider, and I still have one ability left. Do they, like, bend full frost on him? Oh, no, they have frost protection. Root Spear, they're gonna... Yeah. Uh, 17. How would Rot do on that? It's not bad, actually. Weakened. Well, just off the Banshee completely. There we go. Good. So they have, what, two units left? So what are you going to attack? Oh, interesting. You're going to go for the stronger Mammoth. I wouldn't have called that. The boat's going to 
shoot him? Ram him? Okay. That sucks just as bad. I have chart. Oh, wow. I rocked that boat. And devastating charge. Just got to finish him off. Well, that actually was pretty good. That is what is enjoyable about this, right? You can take a match that you're supposed to lose, and well, you don't, so. And one. I don't want to replay that. Got a Kraken. Ooh, and a Boom Dragon. Nice. We'll take those. So is that a... Summon Bone Dragon. Yep, right there. Interesting. Go, Kraken. Explore. <laughs> That's actually pretty sweet. I got a Kraken. Too bad you can't, like... Well, I could levitate those guys. Probably couldn't I? Swimming. Maybe if I recast that, uh, the horse spell, whatever that was, I forget the... Let's be educated and actually... Forget what... Oh, active spells. No. I have no idea. Anyways, that one that got cast at the beginning, that was pretty cool. Alright, so here's my hero. Did Arc Druid just not have any great abilities? I guess I haven't played Arc Druid really all that much, so I might not know, but... Defense. Don't want to take a defense. Because I get in combo with this guy a lot. But he's a fire breath. Defense wouldn't be bad, right? Give me up to 18 defense. That's that's pretty beefy. Let me give me some melee strength. Yeah, we'll go with that. Alright, as for these guys, come back down here. Continue to explore my friend soon to be victim oh jeez probable defeat what did where did that come from really well we're gonna pull out all the stops with my magic um we gotta win this one guys that is awful Ark and Titan jeez all right mass curse dead don't yeah I'm dead or affected by that Beast Horde. Yeah, call the Horde. I mean, what else are we going to do? Let's move our giants back a little bit. Hopefully we'll be able to get some good like lightning breaths and whatnot off, but that is going to take some time, right? Uh, that is a lot of... What are we looking at? Like a thousand hit points I gotta get through before mine expires, essentially? It's kind of sad. I resisted the curse, at least. Well, this is gonna be a little bit longer battle than I might have uh, thought, but... Well, I, I didn't anticipate this. I don't even know where those guys showed up from, but... Probably there's actually that, like, uh, structure up north. It's like the corrupted, bony-looking thing. Um, looks like the dragon skeleton, right? Probably they've been spawning from there forever, and then finally they had victims show up. Are they playing smart? Dang it. They're not clumping up. I need them to clump, but they will not clump. Penguins, go. Spiders. It'd be nice if you could web somebody. Really nice. Yeah, I mean, that's nice, right? But this would be much better use of it. You could probably take it out with a. Take them mostly out with a few volleys of lightning. There we go. Move one, I can probably still. Yeah, use it. There we go. Okay, they're all stunned. That's wonderful. I have that as well, don't I? Alright, well that's actually good if I can essentially be fighting a one... Well, a one flank battle. That's a lot... I like those odds a lot better, I guess. No stuns. That's okay. Archangel. 
Reinforce dire penguins. Save me penguins. Oh, that's not what I... I thought it was penguins. Well, that mammoth rider is dead, guys. We're just going to write him off at this point. I swear the penguin icon was up there. Oh, get off me, dude. Fool. Guard break, that sucks. Is that all they're really going to move? Oh, how did they get two guys up there? What in the world? I did not think that their range. Well, I, I should have been... Hmm. I should have checked that. My hero stays alive. I'm fine if he doesn't. I'm... His fire breath can be. <sighs> okay, he'll regrow a little bit. I can fire breath those giants, which will be good. I think they have fire weakness. Oh, I'm out of abilities, really. All right, well, we're going to make him pay for this, then. Pigs get in... Well, pigs might not finish that. You get up there, you finish this guy off. There we go. You get up here, start engaging our fellow giant. See, I'm strong... Oh, he's entangled. Excellent. Ooh, critical hits. Oh, we totally got this. And when they get entangled, there's nothing they can do. They're just getting straight hit. Okay, we've got our warg who's stuck there. Our penguins who got summoned in. The mammoth rider. get the flank off. Oh, I could actually run away, couldn't I? That'd be funny. Wait, how'd I get there? I feel like that involves, yeah, that involves me getting hit a lot. Alright, well, we might as well go out with a bang if this guy's gonna die anyways. Uh, no spells this turn. And luckily my hero, like, regens kind of a lot every turn. We're going to win this one. I'm pretty proud of that. Maybe a little too soon to celebrate, but I, I'm pretty sure we have this. I don't see how we lose it, per se. The trick is just keeping my big uh, elite units alive. That's what I'm going to want to do. The Beast Hordes haven't really summoned any great places, unfortunately. And they're pretty trashy units. Yeah, it's okay. It's what it is. Okay, fire weakness. Let's burn these guys. Oh, then once again, selecting the wrong guy. Oh, well, 44 for a critical hit is very respectable. So those lightning strikes, I think, really did a lot to just ensure that I'd be okay. Do I want to heal myself or do I want to attack? I kind of want to attack, but let's finish him off with penguins if we can. Guys entangled. That's a question. Do I do I fall back? Maybe it was foolish to move my angel up there. Probably was. Move my angel back. Let's heal myself. Bring you back down here. Uh, over here. It's a way to get keep my hero safe. Cause so I'm just gonna charge my hero again. But I guess if they wanna, they wanna go for that, they can. Be my guest, I guess. Oh, they're setting up to get hurt bad. Why would you clump up like that? Why would you do that? A hundred years, I did not know. Call down lightning, my friends some stuns and some kills okay 
13 is pretty good though, and that's definitely a respectable cast. So he's stunned for a turn. Uh, finish them off. going for it. Uh, the Archangel, did he finish him off? Probably. I guess go for the guy that's not stunned yet. Oh, he's so dead. There we go, rank up. I like it. We've got this. More crappy tier one animals showing up to join the party. That's how it is. Yeah, feel free on uh, this video, guys. Leave me some suggestions on like how bad I play the Arc Druid, because I know I am. Because I'm pretty sure for as like solid of a game this is, they don't have this sucky of just this really sucky class. Pretty sure it's me. So, how oh, sweet! I can get the flank off. Excellent. Is that it? Look at that. That was a probable defeat. We turned that around. That is the power of massive units. Jeez. Alright, well we're going to leave it there. We're not even going to grab this. We'll do that next time. And then this is what I was talking about right there. I'm pretty sure that's where they've been spawning the whole time. Because I don't see a cave or anything they came out of. So... Well, that was kind of a fun video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Lots of battles. Not much on the front of Betraying our friend Roger. Halfling man, but uh, we'll get there. So, thanks for watching. And uh, feel free to post your Arc Druid comments, uh, your Arc Druid suggestions in the comments below. Um, about all I know they're good for is running really fast and with uh, hunters and being super annoying getting around you, taking stuff. So, anyways, thanks for watching, guys. And, uh,. I'll catch you next time.